Well, I don't have that terrible burden of defeat looming over me like the rest of the politicians. You know, I don't care. To me, uh, quite often, failure is the closest way you can find success. Universal healthcare, universal preschool, already happening. Bring it down here. We need it in my town. Yeah. I'm running in his, in, in, in his place. <laughs> good luck. I'm on the ballot. Okay, good luck. Hey, do you like tell him. Gavin to vote for me. Okay, I will tell him. Thank okay. you so much. <laughs> 126 reviews, 120 group shows, 77 lectures, 72 performances, 47 TV appearances, 29 radio interviews, 4 NEA fellowships, 3 books, 3 biennials, 2 honorary PhDs. Uh, that's pretty impressive, by the way. And uh, two websites, 135 millimeter film. That's pretty good. And then I have to say, the, uh, the accomplishment in 1964, where you fell from a museum roof into a sculpture garden uh, at the National Museum. Yeah. That's pretty impressive. Well, I fell. Grabs me and, you know, starts pulling me towards the car and whispered in my ear, you'll have more fun with us, did you? Okay. And then I realized that when I ran the last time in 78, that's when Jarvis Gann and the Prop 13 passed. And at the same time, I was saying that my economic uh, uh, policy would be I would hire Reverend Ike to be in charge of the state treasurer and, and we would be, we'd replace taxes with incredible good luck. 1978. 78, and here like a bad penny, he's back again. Yeah. I got in the ring I, I, because um, I realized the state was in the same situation I was, and we haven't been able to uh, raise or shift taxes in 32 years. So that's, and our schools have gone from the top to number 50 in reading skills. We're going to have a campaign button. Thank you. <laughs> Oh.